Students, how do you remember the formula for finding out the plasma osmolality? It's simple. Just remember two salty and sweet buns. What do I mean by that? Actually, when you measure all the entities in millimole per liter, the formula is simple. It is 2 into serum sodium plus the blood glucose level plus the blood urine nitrogen level. But when we measure as conventionally we do here in our country, when you measure it in milligram per deciliter, there are correction factors to be applied. So the formula becomes 2 into serum sodium that remains the same plus blood glucose divided by 18 plus blood urea nitrogen value divided by 2.8. Why is this formula important? Because sometimes we need to find out what is osmolar gap, which is the lab derived value of plasma osmolarity minus the measured osmolarity according to the formula. If this difference exceeds 15 milli osmoles, then there is a positive osmolar gap. This is important in situations where there is a high anion gap metabolic acidosis. If there is a corresponding high osmolar gap also, then you have to suspect toxins such as ethylene glycol to have been consumed by the patient. So this is how to remember the serum osmolarity formula.